just gonna go ahead and click the record button for you. Oh, word. Yeah. Cause I know you like I know you because you like your little banter. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click the button. Cause I am the one, the only one that is the son that has the gun in the I for, I forgot what I was gonna say. Good. <laughs> dog, what are you doing? I don't know, man. I just like saying it. I just like I just like making up my own stuff for it. I am the one, the only one with the personas to get you in the I don't, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. With the, with the, with the persona? With the persona persona. Dog. Like playing Persona too, too much, man. Dog, oh, Persona Five is life. <laughs> I mean, that's fine. Persona Five is is actually kind of dope. It's got so much new stuff in it. There's so much, and and never played Persona until this one, and I'm just like, how have I not missed this? And I love JRPGs. How have I not played these? But then again, never had a PlayStation games. I, I played Nintendo games a lot growing up. So, I mean, I just wasn't into Persona. I like, I was like, I wasn't. I love. I mean, and I love. I, dude, I sound like such a Sony fanboy now, but like I said, I just I like I like all the games that Sony has because they they do more. Jap- well, Sony is a Japanese company, so it's probably it's, that's the reason why they have so many Japanese ass games. But it's whatever. I love it because I am the one, the only one who has the son that has the gun. <laughs> Can we just start this? I have no idea what I'm talking about. What we do here is go back, 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 back. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Taylor Made Otaku. My name is Taylor, and I, we are here today to give you our thoughts on Attack on Titan Season 2, Episode Number 8. And I say we because I'm joined again by Shooting Star Sheriff. What is up, cuz? Yo, what's going on, guys? What's up, everybody out there at Taylor Made Otaku? It's great to be here. Doug, before we say anything, just, just, just tell me real quick. What? What was your thoughts on the episode as a whole? You want me to be 100% honest? Dog, uh, lay, lay it into me, dog. <laughs> they took Aaron. We have to go save him. Yet again. <laughs> the end. <laughs> the sad part about that is you're not wrong. That was the whole episode. They took Aaron. We're going to get him back. 22 minutes. <laughs> Alright, cool. Review over. I'm out. <laughs> 22 minutes to tell that story. Like, dog, I have seen wasted episodes before. Trust me, I've seen Naruto and Dragon Ball Z and Bleach and One Piece. There have been a lot of just wasted episodes. This was... I'm not going to say this was a wasted episode because things actually happened. Like, it's no ReZero episode 18. If you don't know what that is, by all means, please go watch that. That's the greatest episode of nothing happening. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't wrong. But, just, but to say that it was like a complete waste of an episode is not correct in my book. I'm just saying they could have done a lot more in it. But... Just for laughs, let's go over the episode. Before the before the opening sequence even started, before the opening song even started playing, they took Aaron. They literally, the Colossus Titan fell on him. The Armor Titan bit his neck, ripped him out. They grabbed your beard. Uh, what's his name? Burt Holt turned back into his human form. He jumped on the Colossus Titan, and they ran off into the distance. Five hours later, everybody wakes up, and then they have a random, unnecessary flashback of them fighting over some bread. And then Mikasa and Armin, they're both kind of sad. Then he comes in, big Papa Hans comes in, and he just gives them like the like this quick little pep talk. Like, I got I gotta tell you, Aaron is a fighter. I've never seen him win a fight, but I've never seen him lose either. He'll he'll be fighting until we get there, so don't worry. Everything's gonna be okay. 
He, then he says the ultimate bull, and he's like, I will do whatever it takes to have the days go back to the way they used to be, where I was just some drunk, useless soldier. And I'm just like, every time something pops up where you can help, you leave. But that's that's that, that's that's neither here nor there. You just threw mad shade at Hans. Stop! It's true. You threw mad shade at him. So then he hands him some some rations to eat. And they're just eating it angrily, and then all of a sudden they're just like getting all their forces together. And Krista, I love her. <laughs> I know love you her. do, dog. I, I know her. you do. I know you do. And it was, she says, "I'm not gonna stay here while Ymir is in danger." So she's gonna come with them on the crusade to get back Aaron and Ymir. And then the episode goes from them like mounting their horses and whatnot. And he goes to Aaron waking up. And your mirror's already woke. Aaron ain't got no arms, by the way. <laughs> he ain't got no arms. He ain't got no arms. And he goes to, like, uh... Rainer saying that, hey, you're, you're finally awake now. Now we can talk. And then the episode ends. And that's it. I mean, okay. So, let's... Okay. So... I don't, okay, if you if you don't mind, let me let me just interject real real, real quick. I think I think I, I I feel like this episode was definitely I feel I felt like it might have been hinting at something. Just just now that I'm thinking back to it because Hans Hans did say he's like nothing has changed between you three between Armament Aaron and 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 Mikasa, you know like you know Armament's always been like. Armament's always been like the intelligence. Mikasa has always been the the brawn. She's yeah, she's she's the muscle. And Aaron is. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't even say the leader. He Aaron, just, Aaron, Aaron is, is the man like who the heart of the team. Yeah, he's he's kind of like the center because Aaron's pretty much the reason why the three of them are kind of together in in, in a weird way, if you want to call it that. I just think he's the man who just runs off into danger, and then they're just like, huh, not again. But <laughs> that's pretty much how it goes, though. That is pretty much how it goes. He always just jumps into something, and Mixa has to go like, damn it, now I gotta throw hands. And then Armin's like, damn it, I gotta think of a way to get out of this. Like, <laughs> but, I but mean, they are the best of friends, because, uh, real talk, I, I, after a while, you just gotta let him just go out and get his, and, and take the, and take that L. I mean, but, I mean, it, I think, I think what it, I think it might be setting up for something, possibly, maybe, because it's the three of them. So maybe, so maybe the three of them will become more like, involved. I don't know. Maybe they'll become more involved. I mean, they are very involved in the story now, but maybe something more will happen um, with those three because it's always it's always them three, no matter what. So, <laughs> and we know Aaron can't die if he gets his legs chopped off; they'll grow back. Arms g- chopped off; they'll grow back. <laughs> so, I mean, we'll, we'll see what ha- we'll see what happens. But I think I. It, it was like I said. It was a lot of exposition in this episode. It was just a lot of they're just building up to just you know really just grab Aaron back. I, and I really want to see what the you know how this whole operation is gonna go down because they still got to deal with a colossal titan and an armored titan. So yeah, I'll say one thing. This episode has me a little bit hyped to see next episode because I want to. I want to hear this conversation between Rainer and Aaron because I know how it's going. How it's how it's going to work. Rainer's going to try explaining himself, and Aaron's going to be angsty like I don't want to hear it. And it's going to be pretty funny. I mean, it's. I mean, at this point, it's pretty interesting because, like, I honestly feel like they. I mean, I don't know if it will happen, but the, I mean, they're talking about wiping out humanity. So, but the thing is, is they said, like I said. Rainer said in the previous episode, well, no, before they, the previous episode they were throwing hands, but the episode before that when they were just talking on the, on the wall, he said that we were told, so someone is pulling the strings, who's pulling the strings, we don't know, but someone else is above Rainer and Bar- and, Bar- and Bert Holt, so maybe they're gonna reveal who's really pulling the strings. Uh, b- behind here, I mean, at this point, it 
it, it has to be someone else that can type another guy who can transform or something or maybe maybe there's like a king of all titans that can speak maybe the ape titan. Ape titan maybe the ape, ape titan. titan i mean it's That's it's good. I mean, honestly, it's really up in the air, but it, the, the conversation is going to be interesting because I feel like some 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 bombshells about to be dropped. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's mm-hmm. it. But that's the episode of the nutshell, show, guys. Because uh, what was your favorite part of this episode? My favorite part of this episode. Mm-hmm. Hans. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. To be completely honest, um, Hans, because I, I guess. I mean, as, as much as I make jokes about every time this man shows up, like, <laughs> he runs away. I mean, that's pretty much the joke. Hans shows up. Hans ain't dealing with this mess. He, he, going, he going somewhere else. Uh, but um, I think uh, Hans did say some pretty cool things in this episode. I mean, despite how much we, we know Hans be running away. Um, I think what he, I like, the, the whole, like, I'd rather be, I'd rather be a useless soldier than, you know, fighting all the time. Or, you know, constantly fighting. You know, constantly fighting. Uh, was, I think that was a pretty cool line. I mean... He's basically saying, like, I'd rather... I'd rather get... I'd rather get paid to sit around and drink with my friends and... And, you know, just live my life peacefully than having to, you know, w- wake up and, w- and be like, I'm probably gonna die today. Like, you know, I, I felt that that's kind of like... The whole gist of that, and then you know, just kind of like, you know, it was kind of like a warm moment between you know Hans and uh, Mikasa and Armament. So I, I, that was probably my favorite moment. It's pretty touching, <laughs> as much as we know Aaron Yeager just gonna do whatever he want. <laughs> yep. Duh. This is so small and so insignificant, but it brought me so much joy when I when I picked up on it while we were watching the episode. My favorite part of this entire episode was the fact that nobody calls Krista Historia. Her name is freaking <laughs> Krista. <laughs> they literally went back to calling her Krista mad quick. <laughs> like, they really did. Like, they were just like, we are not calling her Historia. And they just kept going Oh. I, I know that's like small and unnecessary, but it was my favorite part. Hey, hey, man, I, I call her Krista too, <laughs> so you good? Uh, I'm not calling her the story. Though. This this it's the second worst name I've ever heard in my life. But that's neither here nor there. But that's all we got for you guys this time. If you like this video, leave a like. What were your thoughts on this episode? Did you think it was a waste? Did you think it was pretty good? Put that in the comment section down below. If you are super hyped for next episode, put that down below. Please, no spoilers. Zip, zippity, doo zero, none. I can't think of anywhere, any other way to say it. I was going to say nothing, But, no, hey, that's, <laughs> you, you get the point. Uh, do me a huge favor. Go subscribe to my boy Shooting Star Sheriff. We are doing Boku Hero Academy Season 2 on his channel, which are which is pretty dope. It's a pretty dope series. It's a pretty dope channel. Be sure to show him show him some love from the, from the otakus here. Okay. If you're new here and you like the content that me and my friend are putting out and you like the content that I have on the channel, please do not hesitate to subscribe and join the squad. Until next video, guys. Peace out. Later.